Hi there. You're probably watching this video because you've come to the end of a, a friendship and you're trying to figure out how you navigate through that and all those feelings, or maybe it's somebody you know and you want to, to help them. The first thing to remember is that friendships have chapters. Sometimes a friendship serves a purpose in our life for a short period of time or maybe a long, long time. And then it comes to the end of that chapter in our life and it's time to move on for yourself and for the other person. We're all on a journey of learning and evolving and growing. And people do that journey in different ways at different times. I kind of see it as being on a path. And sometimes we get further ahead of the path than the people that we're friends with. And so it's not possible for us to maintain that friendship because we've grown, we've evolved, we've changed, but they haven't quite reached that place on the path yet. And so we have these chapters in our life where the friendship is really the perfect thing for us. It's, it's, it's great. But then because we've changed, we've moved further along that path, that friendship no longer serves us. It may be that there have been things in that friendship that perhaps you've kind of had a niggle, maybe you've had an inner voice that's been saying to you, you know, you're not happy about this situation, but you've been ignoring that voice. But now maybe it's time to have courage to be you. You're being really true to yourself. You're having a more authentic relationship with yourself. You're listening to yourself and you're trusting your inner wisdom and because of that you're wanting to have more authentic relationships with other people you can't have an authentic relationship with yourself and a, a not authentic relationship with other people it doesn't work like that so as you have learned and you have grown it becomes important to have those deeper connected more authentic relationships with people it may be that you've ended a friendship or you're considering ending, ending this friendship and there's a part of you that's saying, well, maybe I should stay friends with this person. We've, you know, we've got a lot of history. We've got a lot of good between us. And that's a wonderful thing. It's been a wonderful chapter. And it may be that you just need some time apart. Maybe this person needs to go off and learn and grow and and, and find their own courage to be themselves and be more authentic and, and learn more about relationships and what they want from relationships and how to treat other people. And for you to be able to go off and find ways to communicate that with other people. And maybe further down the line, maybe you'll meet again and you can come back to your friendship. So it's never about forever but it might be about kind of forever right now. For now, the friendship isn't working. It's a chapter of your life that has come to an end. And even if you did get to be friends with them, come back to a friendship with them again, that would be a new chapter. So what can you learn from this situation? Anything that is difficult in our life that's challenging that we feel has been has gone wrong that we've you know it hasn't worked out if we can ask ourselves what can i learn from that then it was never really such a waste of time it was a valuable experience for us so what can you learn from a friendship that has come to an end what values have you noticed in yourself that because this friendship hasn't worked out, that person's values and your, your values have not been a match? So therefore, whatever it is that they may have done or betrayed you in some way, you now have a clearer idea of what your values are. And once you have a clearer idea of what your values are, it makes it much easier to set boundaries with people because you know what works for you and what doesn't work for you may not be a match for them, but you can communicate that, you can express that to people. And those people who it is a match for will then become your really deep, close friends. It's very much about 
I always say getting out ahead of it. You know, quite often we drift into friendships because that person happens to be in the same workplace or the same club or we just met them uh, by the by along the way and we just like to go out and socialise with them and that's great, that's fine. But actually, if we can be also more intentional about our relationships, to think ahead, get out ahead of it, and think ahead about well, what does matter to me in a friendship? What you know, how can I find find people who share those same values? What sort of conversations can I have with people to understand a little bit more about them and me and our values and and how authentic we can be together and how we might treat each other and how we might respect each other and how we might acknowledge each other's worth. When you can sort of think ahead, get out ahead of that, and be intentional about finding those people in your life, then you can set yourself up to have much better friendships. So if you're ending a friendship or you've ended a friendship, Remember that you are now creating space for better friends to come into your life at this period in time, in this chapter of your life. If you want to find out a little bit more about finding out these, you know, these new friends, watch my video called How to Find Friends Who Treat You Well. You'll find a lot of tips in there. But just to end for now, if you have ended a relationship or you're thinking about ending a relationship, be kind to yourself. Be kind to the other person. Acknowledge the things that have been good in that friendship and maybe let them know that you're grateful for that. But it's time now to start a new chapter. I encourage to be you. If you enjoyed this video, please do hit the thumbs up like button because that means that more people will get to see it and then you're helping me to help them. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications button. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.